when using PIC Pro with Race Control System 64. This light here is for tyre wear, and this light is for fuel. This light here lights up when there's stop and go. These two lights here will flash fast, like this one in the middle, when the level is very low, and when it's below 50%, it will flash slowly. When it is above 50%, it will say a solid red light. I'm going to show you a pit stop. As I come into the pits, this light here will light. The a sound will sound to say that you've entered uh, crossed the first sensor and entered the pits. A uh, brake will be applied for a short length of time because I have a very short pit lane and then the car will revert to safe speed. So it's reverted to safe speed. Press brake and Main changer together, start refuel and then exit. As I exit, sound will be heard and then speed will revert to normal. So to use Pit Pro you need to first of all check this box here. You can choose the advanced Pit Pro light system which I just explained. The break time here, you can put in whatever you want. I would normally have it at point, uh, one of a second, just to give a, a slight bit of braking to, just as I enter. This here, you can have, as I have it set for the pit in and out sensors, or to use the start finish as your out sensor and use just the sensor from the PIT Pro as your entry PIT sensor. PIT out when exit PIT menu or you can just use the lights option. When you start up PIT Pro you need to check that uh, the correct COM port has been chosen. If you click on the check button then the lights should light if it is connected. If it isn't connected properly, which I can't show you, but normally there will be a few uh, COM ports there. You choose the right one and then you would try click to check again. And that's PIT Pro with Race Control System 64.